Nikara is our latest product um, dedicated uh, for new imaging. Nikara actually stands for Neuroimaging Based Connectome Assessments and Research and um, Application. Now, it's, it's much more than just a connectome tool, but that makes it stand out because it's the first tool in the world that uh, enables user to run fully um, automated processings of uh, connectomes and make uh, feature assessments and statistical comparisons in the tool. So, but also more grounded features and methods, for example, conventional MRI um, and uh, for, so structural imaging, we provide features for that. Processing routines, for example, for voxel-based and surface-based morphometry that a lot of people may know and also use in their clinical trials. So um, the uniqueness of the system is that we directly combine pipelines with each other. So we basically started off from connectome assessments and used the same high precision pipelines that we need for doing connectomics, also for morphometry analysis. Um, so for example, surface-based uh, analysis. And we found out in longitudinal trials that we did, um, especially also with um, public data, um, that our uh, technology is quite superior to other technologies. And um, also um, the, the way we do the statistical assessments using, for example, values like annual percent change to correct, uh, to correct for variations uh, in, in, in the observation intervals, uh, and also how to do the, um, the statistics and multiple um, testing correction is, is quite unique. We, we just pub um, are about to publish this, the paper is accepted. And um, so we think that uh, Nikara can uh, make quite a contribution to the field of uh, clinical trials um, because having a, um, a dedicated um, pipeline um, can, can really lead to a good um, um, study outcomes, even if the, uh, the, the study sizes are quite small. So we started off with really a, lum a limited number of uh, research subjects from AD. Uh, from the uh, ADNI uh, cohort, um, the public uh, cohort database for Alzheimer's patients. And we saw um, really highly significant uh, differences in changes over time uh, between the um, cognitive normal and the Alzheimer disease uh, patients. And um, uh, this, this, these results can be transferred to clinical trials. So when you have, when you, especially when you start a clinical uh, trial on a new drug candidate, you don't have the big budget to, to go for, um, for several hundreds or thousands of participants. And you want to have uh, something to start with and uh, having good uh, and significant uh, results to ask for the next stage and, and to proceed. And here we see a, a big contribution. So Nikala is really cost efficient. Um, it, um, it doesn't need a lot of expert knowledge. The expert knowledge is uh, built into the system and uh, you can just press the button and run these pipelines analysis uh, and, and um, uh, do the statistical assessments. And um, with this, you don't need to hire a big uh, and cost expensive, uh, extensive imaging team. You can just do this by yourself uh, as a small group, for example. And then you can also use Nikara if it goes uh, to larger clinical trials. It comes with a full um, project management, study management, uh, quality assurance. Um, it, it can be um, run um, as a um, uh, as a uh, distributed system. So if you have um, many partners uh, contributing to a trial, all can log into the same uh, installation. And so, for example, the imaging centers can um, um, uh, upload their raw imaging files to the Nikara server. There you run the um, processing pipeline. So all the same processing uh, pipeline for the same um, participants, no matter from which center they come. And then you have this everything, all the data together to run the assessments. Um, and I think that that's really a game changer uh, in the field of clinical trials. Um, moreover, and that really um, is directed to the future, 
when you um, uh, want to more, do more um, sophisticated measurements, uh, for example, you really want to include um, connectomics into a clinical trial, or you want to um, combine multimodal um, uh, measurements. For example, you want to compare findings that you see in PET imaging with, um, for example, volume loss uh, that you see in conventional MRI. Um, then you have a tool to bring the things together. Um, and there are also um, uh, custom installations possible. So we can configure um, a, a, a project, um, a, a Nikara version for the individual customer. So um, really dedicated um, to the customer's data to make really more out of um, his or her client um, trial data. So um, that's in a nutshell what you can really do with the system. And um, we think there's a great future for that. At the moment, it's, um, uh, it's a product that's pretty new. It's uh, tested um, in, in many collaborations and more scientific collaborations. We have started the first partnership uh, with NeuroCEOS, um, who are also um, one of the um, participants and also um, um, uh, contributing or hosting this uh, this meeting, this ADPD meeting, and uh, we are quite proud to be um, already known a bit in this uh, uh, in this community, and uh, we hope for much more. I think a lot of more things uh, are possible here. Yeah.